I think the, the density of AI in our lives is now ramping up so much. It's, we're now at the point where it's um, becoming confusing, we feel slightly out of control. So it's a really good time to pull back and just reflect on this moment and really develop some kind of pathway for ourselves through it. It was important to us to track back the idea of AI to really the Middle Ages because what we see there is that people had the desire to bring the inanimate to life. So the desire to extend intelligence, create some kind of machinic intelligence beyond our own is actually something that's part of who we are. Uh, and we have some wonderful pieces which show uh, the history of the golem, that, the Jewish story of the golem. It's opening new avenues. Uh, it, it, it's able to surprise me. Uh, I have this interaction with a machine which is somewhat controllable but at the same time unpredictable and I can make discoveries that I cannot make in the real world. The installation shows that the machines are not all powerful yet because uh, while I'm watching it, it is sometimes able to surprise me, but most of the time you can see how much garbage it produces. So it's, we haven't reached the point where, like, where we are being replaced. I think, yeah, it's strong, but uh, it's not strong enough to play professional Go player because we, we play all our, our life in this game. So, but after playing with AlphaGo, everything is changed because I lose 5-0 and uh, it's uh, difficult for me. But something totally changed, not just in my game, in my style, and also in my life because I see another world different than before. This is a great exper experiment for me. AI 
AI for me is just a tool. It's like we can run it, but we can run it more fa we can never faster than the car, right? We can paint it, but we can never paint, paint like the photo, the clear, but, but just a tool. Never, nobody make a competition for this. I will run, I run very fast, so I will run with a car. Never, it's just a tool. One tool can help us to see something different and far away. Uh -huh.